Welcome back to City Skylines. Today, we're building an area just for the rich. The center of our city is in working progress. We've got the park, we've got the main train station in the center that will connect all the cities and suburbs around it together. Guys, welcome back to another Let's Play video of City Skylines, the green power scenario or the green cities DLC. Guys, hope you're doing super awesome today. This here is Green City or Project Green City. It is underway and doing fantastic. Fantastic. Guys, in the last episode, we built, we built, not this, we built, what did we build? We built all of this. I'm actually thinking, like, what did we do in the last episode? And I'm trying to just think what's going on. But in the last episode, we built this area right here. This here will be our tourism sector right here. And, uh, yeah, we've got, like, little jetties where you can hire a boat. Um, that's pretty much everywhere. You can hire some jet skis. As you can see, the water goes up and down once you're terraforming a little bit. But you can hire a jet ski. And we've got some cafes on the water here, which is pretty cool. And we'll have like different types of, you know, like residential areas around here and like commercial areas around. Because it's going to be like a tourism sector here. We've got a, our own train station here with the university or the TAFE University. Our trade school will have its own football stadium just down here, which is going to be really, really cool. As if there's a tourism sector, then you've got this area. Beautiful. This is going to be the money-making machine. But what else did we do in that episode? Guys, we started building all of this up. So, our park has been brought over from the other side. This is our old city over here. We've got all of our industries over here. If you didn't check those videos out, guys, go check these out. Uh, we've got our, all of our efficient oil industries. We only got three out of four industries. And this is the city we started off at. And as you can see, we've expanded over to here. We've got our trade school here. Over the river, we've got our another small city over here. And this park here is going to be ripped out. And we've actually taken in that park and we brought it over to here. So let's get out of here and you can see that this is a park over here. We don't have the main here but it's going to be Chirpy Land Park over here. We're doing pretty well. So yeah they're all complaining about water and all that because we haven't got the services in here yet. We've got the main train station and um, yeah the main train station goes over the road. We've got like this nice you know I don't know we're going to most probably do something in here or we'll have train tracks going under the you know road here which could be pretty cool but the roads are going around here. This will be or offices and like I discussed in the last episode the center will be offices and then on the outside of the offices will be high-rise apartments then the next district like the next stage then then say so we'll go offices followed by high-rise apartments followed by to buy mid-rise apartments to low-rise um, apartments to then low residential so by the time you get out here to the mountain and over here will be low high-rise and low residential over over here but this whole area right pretty much right here is all going to be high rise like high density to low dense to medium density um residential and, and office and commercial zoning in this area here but as you see we've got the train station connected here which connects over to here and today guys we're going to be focusing on one new area of our city if we follow the coastline freeway yes you do see a road here we are going to play with this one today and come along the road we come into this junction this area right here is gonna be called billionaires cove guys this is gonna be the place for the rich only the rich suburb the billionaires cove that's what we're gonna name the district but this is where the rich will live we're gonna make sure this has got fine the finest quality of everything in this area here all of this area here which is gonna be super cool and um really cool i think it's gonna be a really cool area to build up which is cool and another thing we are gonna build today is something that's gonna go over into this area right here now unfortunately the only way you're going to see what's in here is if you go along the Ocean Drive um, road, which is our freeway, which goes along the Ocean Drive. Um, so we're actually going to have all of our services down here that will actually supply all of this area here with power, water, and everything else that you could possibly want. Everything like that will be supplied and sourced down in this area here for this whole suburb, right? That is going to be our utility hub along here, and then we're going to have everything else, you know, scattered around. But another thing I also would like to do today is build a train station from um where do we got we got this side here so i want to get a train station into this area here which comes up into this area probably want to extend the train station from here over into this area i also want to start maybe today uh get all the road layouts like this whole patch of grass here road layout done into here want to get the road layout done in this area here probably in this area and this area too and probably this whole batch of grass in here and like i said 
right, we've got a plan on how we want to do residential zoning. So we'll make sure we have our main road in between the two sets and whatnot. Guys, I think you guys get what we're trying to say. Guys, like always, if you did enjoy today's video, guys, smash a like on today's video, guys. Can we have five likes on today's video, guys? That'd be greatly appreciated. And guys, if you don't want to miss out on any new videos of City Skylines, of the Project Green City, that's the project we're doing right now. If you don't want to miss out on any new videos of City Skylines, guys, make sure you go down below and smash the red subscribe button down below. Guys, thank you for all your love and support on, on all these videos, guys. Last week was the end of our Farming Simulator series. And guess what, guys? Get ready. Get pumped up because this Thursday and Sunday at 12 a.m. Australian Eastern Time, Software Rink Beta 1 is coming back to the channel. You guys wanted to see Beta 1 at the end of our last series of Software Rink. I ended the series to go to, so to Farming Simulator and you guys wanted to see Beta 1 so, so badly. So instead of waiting another series, guys, Software Rink Beta 1 is coming this week. Thursday and Sunday at 12 a.m. Australian Eastern Time. Guys, get ready for the new series. It's going to be absolutely awesome. I can't wait to start recording it tomorrow. At the time I'm recording this, which is Monday. So Tuesday, I'm going to be recording Software Rink. I can't wait to get into Software Rink again, Beta 1. It's going to be interesting. Will I screw the game up? Possibly. But I think with your love and support, guys, on the other side of this screen or the other side of this camera right here, guys, you are going to do some awesome things letting us know what we are going to do. We're actually going to be doing a company and we're actually going to be doing a full way, like a four, four people um, as CEOs. I'm not going to talk much about it. You guys are going to need to check the video out on Thursday to see what we do. All right, let's get straight into today's video. Let's have a look what we are going to do. Now, I do want to do a bit of a time lapse, actually, but I think um, while you guys are here, we're going to build up some roads. So that is honestly what we're going to do. Now, I'm planning on that the main density of our traffic will be up in this area here. I don't plan to have a lot of our traffic down into this area here. Um, so I think we're going to stick with our normal type of road, which will be here. So where, how, how we've gone, we've gone like this and then we've taken it out by 13. All right. So we're coming to here. We'll go out by 13. We'll go down. There we go. Now we're on the road, nicely on the grass. There we go. And we most probably will actually take this down into here, but it might be nice to come into here and maybe come up into there. So let's go use our magic tool here and we're going to come and connect into here maybe. Will that be good? Because we do have our park here and I don't want to make sure. Let's have a look. Let's go. What are we? Let's, uh, okay. Let's go. 40. Can I get this uh, snapped on nicely? Come on, game. All right. So we might come around like this and then we could come around like that. All right. So that should be A-OK. -okay. And then we probably want to, this here is a junction there. So we possibly could use this junction to come around like this, but then that's going to be too close, wouldn't it? Okay, so maybe go from here, we could come up. No, that's going to look too weird. Weird, weird, weird. And I don't want it to look weird, and I also don't want it to be too close, right? So we've got to try and make sure our roads are set up nicely, right? Because if our roads are not set up nicely, they're going to look trash, right? So a nice little S-bend here looks quite nice, and I think it'll do fantastic wonders for us. And I might do also the same down into this area, right? So we'll come down into this area like so. Nice roundness. Beautiful. And we can connect you in like that. There we go. So we've got nice roundness and it just connects up all the main roads nicely. All right. That looks good. I don't think I'm going to do much here. I don't think I'm going to do much. We might even connect a lot of it on the main road here, which should be not too bad. And I think I might just let these areas up here for the next episode or the video that we are actually going to record today. So let's come back into here. We're going to go to our two lane roads and I'm really digging the straight designs, right? Maybe as we come closer to over here, we might want to try and change something up. So this is a junction. I don't want to connect through the junctions. So I think we are going to connect over into this area here somewhere. Let's have a look. Let's go with a nice straight road up. So we'll go into down like this and I think here would also be really cool. All right. So like there should be a okay and we'll go like this we'll go like that and we could probably go like this a nice roundness to it 
go up and like this. No, we could go. Actually, we'll go like this. We're up by 20. That looks all right, doesn't it? And we can then go up by 20. Whoopsie daisy. Oh, jeez. All right, let's go like this. We'll go up by 10 and all right. Can we do something cool? Like there would be all right. Yeah, that should be okay like that, shouldn't it? Yeah, why not? Why not? Go connect this one up like this. Beautiful. We won't try and make this area look impressive. We're not going to try and make it look very, very impressive. There we go. We'll just try and go up like this. And then maybe we just delete this road. And we come up and we come over like this. That looks all right. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. We do something a little bit different. There we go. All right. And come down and like that. We'll have to... It'll be a sharp road there. But that should be all right. Just fills it up a little bit. All right. That looks all right. It looks not too bad. And then we could just do some nice straight roads over in this area here. So we will want to make sure that we are at a 90 degree angle. We always like to have angles. And that area won't need to be filled up, but that's all right. And then we'll just get this into there, this area. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. My God, it looks so beautiful. <laughs> oh, God. All right. So let's get this road up. We're going to connect this all the way up to here. Beautiful. <laughs> yes, Aiden. Everything is beautiful these days. Everything is beautiful. There we go. We'll connect this road up into there. We'll also connect that road into there. Beautiful. So they've got a nice access around the place. And we are just going to make sure we connect all these roads up nicely. Nicely, nicely. Beautiful. I love this city. I think we're doing really good. Guys, comment down below. Do you like this series so far? Do you like, like this project that we are building? Guys, comment down below. I would love to know what you guys think of the project so far. And if you guys like it. If not, also tell me that down below. But there you go. That is that part of the road finished. Um, I probably won't connect. I could probably could. I could connect something in there. I could come around like 40 and then go straight out 180 as far as I can at 180. That could be all right. And I think that'd be all right like this. And then we could get another road in. Just trying to think on where I would like to put it. Put it in about here at 75 a day, guys. That's too close. We could go like this. That looks all right. We just want to try and make sure we're going to have enough room when we do pedestrian cross things and all of that jazz all right so we've got to make sure we've got enough room for all of that push this up into that area beautiful all right enough area of room here that is all right bring this up beautiful all right and this is a very very interesting road layout we could bring this into here mm, okay let's go let's go about 75 and we'll bring this in like that then let's say we do 180 180 right to the bridge there we go all right then let's say let's not do this let's go here here and we'll just go 10 like this we'll turn that around and go right into the top there all right that should be all right like this we can then go down like that some nice strands of road beautiful all right and that's connected there so that's all right we don't need to make sure we've got too much connection there all right that's there and we might just get a road that comes down into there somehow that looks not too bad we will just get a nice little curved road that comes down into this area there all right fills that up beautiful i like to see what when things get filled up, filled up. All right. So we will come up like this. Come up through there. Actually, <coughs> so a lot of this area here is still green. I think I'll leave it. I think I'll leave it. But there we go. We've already added in a few new roads. And that is doing really, really well. All right. So what we are going to do now is we're going to get straight to... Straight? I know how to talk. We are going to get straight into creating Billionaire's Cove over here. We're going to do Billionaire's Cove. We'll design all this. We'll get this all built up. And then we're also going to start working on over in this area here. And this area will be dedicated to our utility hub. So I think we might do utility hub first and then we'll do, in, do this area. I don't know what I plan to do but we are just going to get straight into it. Guys with that said, enjoy the time lapse. I don't know what I'm saying. Let's just get to building Project Green City. Let's go.
possible. Billy Nance Cove is built up now. Check it out. We're just going to place a district on it now. Let's place the district in. Billy Nance Cove is here. Let's place the district in. I did say that. Um, I keep repeating myself, but the district is going in. And just being super careful to cut a lot of this area out. All the little its and bitses of the area needs to be cut out like so. Ugh. Oh, jeez. That is so hard. Oh, there we go. All right. District is in. Check it out. Looking fantastic. Myrtle Square. Well, no. More like Billionaire Co. There it is. Press enter and it is in. Beautiful. Alright, let's set some policies up for this area. I am going to make sure that we have unticked everything so we can go through here and set some policies we're in this area. Alright. Services. We're going to make sure that they are recycling, right? We're going to do parks, education, boost free public transport no 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 helicopter higher ticket prices yes 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 all right what else we're we gonna do recycle plastics recycling centers work 20% efficient all right recycle plastic that will do and um what are we doing here recycling what does it do slightly reduce garbage accumulation okay that's fine actually let's just do this because we can then um it cost 100 cents per recycling center per week right but you get 20% more efficient so that's pretty damn good. Alright, free Wi-Fi? No. For profit education we will do and that will be it for you. Taxation, however, will be a tax rise for everything. Tax, not tax relief, not tax relief. Tax rise for low residential, tax rise for high density and tax rise for low dense, high dense. Actually, do we do high density? Let's go low dense. I think this area is going to be more low density. So low density, uh, residential, low density, commercial and and that should be it. Tax rise for each of them. All right. High tech housing. We're going to have high tech housing. We're going to have a high rise. We're going to have a heavy traffic ban. We're going to encourage biking. Uh, lightning rods. That could be cool. Fast recovery. No rebuilding. Fast recovery. For those of you not. Nah, combustion engine ban. Only electric cars are allowed in the affected area. We're going to make sure there's electric cars. Electric cars. Combustion engine ban. Oh, no. We won't do that because otherwise we won't be able to get things in. Filter. Industrial waste, boost connections. Not nah, that is it. So what do we got? We got a tax raise for low res. Let no. Let, 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 let. We got high ticket prices. We got red recycle plastic for proper education. Tax raise for low density and low density residential and commercial and city planning. We got high tech housing, heavy traffic demand, encouraged biking, electric cars. There we go. This is what we call Billionaires Cove. There we go. We got a train station in. We got some. Uh, 
services all over the place. What do we got? We've got like a sports hall and gymnast here. We've got schools around the place. We've got a community pool, which is like super cool. We got the <laughs> We've got the Statue of Liberty right at the end here. Right over the end. Overlooking the harbour. And if we have a look over here. Oh no. We've had a bit of a fire. But oh well. We don't really care what goes on on that side of the city. Because we're more focused on the new side of the city. Okay. Let's have a look. This is our little area over to here. So this here is going to be our utility hub. Everything is switched off at the moment. But we've got all of our pumping stations here. We've got all of our fresh water outlets. So any water that we are not using using is exported right here which is a beautiful spot to export our water right here back into filling it up into the system so it's like like we use it and if we don't use it we ex we take it we, we let it out and then we use it again like pretty much yeah because we're pumping it there <laughs> so we've got some tank reservoirs just here which is pretty cool so we've got additional storage for water we've got pumping services here just in case waters um do, does reach war, um, road level or tunnels we'll be able to pump it out which is cool we've got all of our solar updrafts here which produce will produce a lot of power and then we've just got normal generic solar power plant followed by that we've got a lot of recycling plants we've got a few advanced water treatment inlands followed by some more recycling and some more um, um sewage treatment but not all of this will be switched on in the new area because this is pretty much going to facilitate this whole area plus what's ever happening up here um we're going to make sure highway speeds are up to standards too so you know we look at highway speeds are at 100 so i want to make sure our highway speeds are going a lot faster than that but we got everything else built up i was going to build some train stations out here but i am running out of time today for today's video i've got a few other things to get done today but the park is in everything is doing fantastic i'm really happy with what we've been able to achieve today the utility hub and billionaires cove check it out i can't wait to see people in this area now as you see we've currently got cars going around the place going to bouncy castles and all that so this area is slowly getting used, but it's only infrastructure and we are paying a lot of money. So let's pause the game right there. I think in the next episode, we are going to start bringing people into the area. I think um, I think that's going to be the goal to start getting people into the area, start getting people to start working into the area, um, start zoning parts of the area. So, you know, start getting some office zoning in here, start getting some residential, high density residential in, you know, um, area here as well, start getting this area occupied in terms of electricity it's doing not too bad but start trying to get a few bits and pieces in because we are losing money and i don't think we're gonna gain much money anytime soon as you see it's, it's yeah i don't know we're making money oh there we go <laughs> there we go making make it not making make it not anyway that's gonna be it for today's video guys if you did go and enjoy today's video smash a like on the today's video i don't know how long today's video is but it probably is a quick episode but billionaires cove is built and our utility area has been built up they were the two main things i need Needed to get done in today's video guys what's next you may ask what is next aiden well i think the next thing really is is actually um people moving in i think really the next thing is definitely guys is people are moving into the city i think i think that's the goal people are moving into the city billionaires cove will need people our sit main part of our city needs people right and um we might just upgrade and make sure update all the trends transport infrastructure next i think that's going to be the next thing that we need to do all right so we've got our train station here can people walk around okay maybe okay well, that's cool if, if so that's cool you know do we put a tram line in here or what do we do to get people around the city right we need to get people around the city we've got to get people maybe down into this area right maybe from the train station we've got to get people down into here how do we get people down into here you may ask we may need to get maybe a monorail system in or we might get a metro system in um maybe something that's above ground might be cool because what do we have what do we have we've got like these tram trolley buses we've got trams that we could put in you know tram tracks you know could be cool um how, how are they so you got the tram track and then the two so you know we could add that in here and you know that the tram tracks might be good decent for us to use you know we've got metros we can look at but maybe they might take up a little bit too much room so i think next episode 
episode is definitely a transport episode. Filling in this area, making sure we've got all of our transport needs are met in this area. So there's going to be more of a transport um, episode next episode, I think. Um, yeah, I want to make sure we've got enough transport around the city to get people from the main station to wherever they want to do go, right? Our goal is in this um, city, um, as much traffic as possible needs to go, right? We need to get rid of all of our traffic as much as possible. I don't want 100% traffic on the road, right? I need to cut that down by 50%, even more. So having our transport network fixed up and integrated into this city, while it's raw, right? It is a raw city at the moment. There's no people living here. There's no traffic, there's no nothing. It's raw at the moment. Let's try and fix this transport up. Get the right transport in place around the city so make sure our folks can travel wherever they want, um, whatever line. But that is gonna be it for today's video. But transport is gonna be next. Got our utility hub and Billionaire's Cove. Look at the Statue of Liberty. Billionaire's Cove is super awesome, guys. I'm super happy with what we are able to achieve. But next episode, it's all about transport, 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 and transport. Getting people in and out of the city as efficient as possible. Guys, make sure you enjoyed today's video. Smash the like on the video. For see more videos like this one, make sure you click subscribe button right here. Click on me to watch the last video. Click on here to watch the full photos of City Skylines, guys. I'll catch you on Thursday video at 12 a.m. Australian Eastern Time, guys. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll catch you then.